This poem is titled Sejolius. At the forge of Hamad Durnal, I looked upon the flame of Annandil flickering above the hearth and became one with it. The forging of a weapon, or was it a key, or was it both? How do I walk into the valley? What shall I see there? What role will I play? Will I die there? I have opened the door to Shinar, the plains where our ancestors assaulted heaven and nearly breached it. I wonder if there are any stones left with the old language still in them, any brick with which to build. On the path, a banshee's kiss, more of a lick, or telling death. At the door, the host took us in, set a table for us, and enjoined us to eat. Bless this meal and the beast we are about to receive. The stories were laid aside, the tales of old, and I saw the ache of the world, like a wounded cur shivering in the corner. I took it up and laid its head on my lap and wept for it. My tears ran down my beard and fell into the eyes of the beast, for they splashed like little flames mingling with its tears. Together they washed the wound until the world stood before me whole again, and I blessed God for allowing me to be part of it. Part two. But something else was born of that union, something dark, layered in feathers of smoke and tall as a horse. It could have been a horse, but for the head, torso, and arms of a man, where the neck and head of the horse should be. Two great wings pressed against its flanks, and its legs and haunches rippled with muscles. It must have been waiting in the forge, hiding in the folds of the flame. There are no rules for these sorts of encounters, no self-help books you can con consult. You must believe that things will work out. I knew immediately that the winged centaur, Sejolius, that's the name he gave me, and I were linked, paired, tangled, and that we would need each other to reach the end of this. Part three. It weren't, if it weren't for this thorn in the flesh, I would have no hope at all. Your best is enough, Panda Express. I cannot say if that is so. I've never done my best. But you can't loose a winged centaur on the world and just walk away. <laughs>